Hi everyone, welcome to checking out my old songs. Now, by my old songs, you may think that I mean like the launch. No, we're going twice as old as the launch. That was from late 2015 I made that song. We're going to 2013. Okay? So we're going to be going some super old stuff. This is the kind of stuff I used to make in GarageBand. I wasn't producing under Indigo 132 yet. I was just having fun, and I think that was okay. I was like nine, and I, you know, I was just having a good time. So that's kind of, sometimes I like to look back on these songs, and I wanted to share them with you. So yeah, let's listen to those. Um, I want to show you a song I made a long time ago called Crocodile Tale with GarageBand, and I used autoplay. There were no loops yet in GarageBand when I made these. So this is, uh, I used, like, autoplay on keyboards to make some of these. But here's one that I made. Oh, there it is. There's some more instruments later in it, but, yeah. So, I don't, I don't think I was necessarily trying to produce EDM. I was just making songs, which I think was okay. Just, they're just not very good songs, but they're fun to laugh at. Now I'm going to show you another one. Uh, I've got Bluetooth on now, so that you can hear it a little better. Uh, here's one that I made called Power Piano. So yeah, this one has some keyboards in it. I want you to hear that, but... There's a ton of these, I'm not going to show you all of them. But, yeah, let's just sit back and relax and listen to this song. If you want to skip it and listen to me talking again, you can skip about a minute later in this video. So that was the whole thing. That wasn't a very long song at all. But yeah, there's a ton of those. If you Tell me if you want me to make another one of these videos in the future so you can hear more of those. Um, now, I'm going to go even earlier than that. We're going to do some really crazy old stuff. I made this entire CD out of songs that I was just making, like, humming. I hummed these songs completely unpredict- I was completely not planning on what I was gonna do. I was just humming and I recorded it and I made it a, I made a CD out of it. So that was great. <laughs> uh, here, I'll show you one of those. Um, first I'll show you probably the best one on it, and then I'll show you probably what was the worst one. Um, here. I'll show you the best one. Oh, it, I don't have it. I don't have these songs. Really? I don't have these songs. I have a CD. I still have the CD with it. But I don't know. I'd have to, like, get a CD player, and I don't... <laughs> we don't have, like, a CD player sitting around our house. So, uh... I'm sorry. I can't show those to you. I wish I could, though. Oh, I thought I could. Maybe some of them I can. Here, there's one of these I can show you that I made called Get Up and Dance. 
Oops, sorry. We'll have to start it over. Ask me what this is? I have no idea. I named this song Get Up and Dance. Okay, well, anyway, I have this other song that I made. I, you know what? I just typed the name in wrong. <laughs> I thought the song was called Red and Green. It was called Red and White. That's why I thought they weren't on here. They are, so I can show them to you. Sorry about all that confusion, but... Can you hear how high my voice is? Four years ago, I was making this. You know, people like, uh, I don't know. Stephen Walking, Peg Warner's, they were producing, like, dubstep, while well, Stephen Walking was producing, like, Glitch Hop or whatever. That was, like, in his Glitch Hop phase. I was making this. I, w I had no awareness of EDM. I was just humming my, humming my days away. This whole song, you can skip maybe like a minute into the video after this. This is some kind of chorus thing. I don't know what this is. So that was an interesting song. Tell me your opinions in the comments. Okay. Now I'm going to show you the the worst one on here. Um, the funniest song on all of here is the one called Sharp Knife, and here it is. I was like a little kid when I made these. Cause you, can, you can tell from my voice. Oh yeah, I guess this part is not... I mean, I had some interesting ideas, but humming them was not the way to carry them out. What was I saying? Admire? Admire. Admire. And I'm screaming. So, let's check out another one. Uh, let me show you another funny one on here that I made called Upbeat. I just misspelled it as Upbeer. That was a mistake. <laughs> but anyway, this is uh, one that I made called Upbeat. I was trying to make it sound heavy. It didn't really turn out that way, but have a listen. I knew how to put echo effects on things, so I was really into that. This 
will probably be the last one because it's getting long. Actually, I have one more I'm going to show you. <laughs> well, anyway, that's, that's just weird. But I'm going to show you one more that I made called Confusing. And I mixed some instruments in GarageBand with my mouth to make a song that really is confusing. And that's why I named it Confusing. That was the whole point. It wasn't meant to be a song. It was meant to be a mess of confusing sounds. So that's this. Skip about a minute forward if you don't want to hear this song. The end of it is okay because it doesn't have me in it. So that was pretty much it for this video. I'm sorry it turned out so long, but if you enjoyed it, tell me, and we'll listen to some more of those old songs. I've got plenty more where that came from that we can listen to in a future video. So yeah, thanks for watching this video. If you're wondering what in the world this view angle is, I just wanted to make it more interesting than a black screen, uh, while also keeping my face out of the video. So yeah, uh, bye. Thanks for watching.